An alarming new report from the University of California, San Diego, found that one in eight incoming freshmen have math skills that fall below high school level. Wall Street Journal came out with an article saying what I've been saying now for years, and that is that, surprise, surprise, college students, even those who graduated with A's from high school, uh, can't do elementary school math. So here's the Wall Street Journal article. It just came out uh, apparently Sunday, Sunday's Wall Street Journal, that college students who the college students who can't do elementary math. It's really shocking, is that um, they, they come into college not being able to add fractions. And I found this nobody knows how to add fractions. Remarkably, among this, remarkably, they're shocked. Among the students placed in that math course, 94% had completed an advanced math class in high school, which means pre-calculus, calculus, statistics, and received an average of an A or an A minus rather in their math scores courses. It, one of the facts, if I got this correct, is that the high school students who can't really perform at high school level nonetheless got A's or A minuses on the grades in math. That's right. They, they uh, had an average GPA in their math high school classes of an A minus. Now, this just uh, reflects the overall grade inflation you're seeing in high schools and probably it all goes all the way to middle schools and elementary schools where they just pass kids along even when they're not proficient. Um. The teachers, what he said is exactly right. I, I mean, not most. Many math teachers, I've met, personally met several math teachers, both teachers in middle school, elementary school, middle school, high school, tutors, special ed tutors in middle school and high school, public school and private, who don't know math at all, don't know, middle, middle, don't know, can't do fifth grade math. So this is what I do. This is what I'm passionate about. If you want to find out how to fix this, click the link below.